Welcome back. The head of a powerful New York family, a loyal consigliere turned informant, wealthy lieutenants facing time in the slammer. It's the stuff they make movies about. And that's the subject of this week's State of the Cartoonian. Folks have been making some really unfair Trump Godfather references for quite some time. I know you're a sophisticated guy. The world is a mess. The world is as angry as it gets. Even White House insiders such as Steve Bannon have been known to unfairly and cruelly compare Donald Trump Jr. to Fredo Corleone. I was kept pretty much in the dark. I didn't know all that much. But the mob film that came to our mind this week was Goodfellas. Never ran on your friends and always keep your mouth shut. Specifically, former Trump fixer Michael Cohen in the Ray Liotta role. It's gonna be a good summer. <laughs> seduced by the high-flying lifestyle, but eventually turning informant to the FBI. It's said that I should take responsibility for his dirty deeds. Now take me to jail. We see former Trump campaign chairman Paul Manafort as the Paul Sorvino character, perhaps behind bars, managing to wheel and deal his way to a nicer situation. Don't put too many onions in the sauce. Then our imaginations went wild and pictured these two former Trump insiders in a Shawshank Redemption-style partnership on the inside, strategizing their way to a prison break. I have to remind myself that some birds aren't meant to be caged. Only instead of a Rita Hayworth poster, maybe someone else would be more fitting. I don't feel like a prisoner. It's something I think a lot about while scrolling through Twitter. Why are Americans so angry? That's next.